big problem when the divisor is bigger than dividend so in this video i'll be teaching you how to divide when a divisor is bigger than dividend all right so here i'll be showing you example number one suppose 9 by 48 so the dividend is smaller and the divisor is bigger always remember that this all are <coughs> positives this all are positive but the thing is when the divide the when the divisor is bigger than dividend then always point comes in quotient all right so now here i'll be showing you here is 48 and here is 9 so now always a zero will come a zero point in the quotient and now we can start our and zero point and here a zero will be placed zero point always remember when you place zero point in the quotient a zero will be replaced here all right zero point zero so how many times 90 comes in 48 now it's just kind of simple division you can just do all right so now if i replace here 2 then 48 into 2 is equal to 96 so it won't happen so i have to take 1 and 48 2 plus 5 it's 4 42 and now we need to just replace a 0 over here 48 so how many times 420 comes in 42 so I need to just um, multiply so I think it's 8 I just check it out 48 48 into 8, 88 is equal to 64, 64 and 48 is equal to uh, 32. Alright, so it's, it is 384. And 10 will come here. 10 minus 36 plus 1 is equal to 9. 12 equal to 3 plus 1 all right 0 again add a 0 okay so it's just kind of when the reminder is not 0 that time you need to play 0 so when the point is up already when the point is situated up when the point is situated up already that time we need to just add zeros to get the reminder as zero because when we get the reminder as zero that time the division is complete all right 360 and how many times it comes all right so 48 into 6 i just check it out 8 into 6 is equal to 8 in 6 is equal to 48. 4 6 is equal to 24. And 24. 28. And I'll just check it out what will be for um, 48 into 7. 8 7 is equal to 56. 4 7 is equal to 28. And 28. And 28 plus 5 is equal to 29 30 31 32 33 all right so we i think yeah so it will be seven over here three three six over here again ten four plus one four six minus four is equal to two and now three two minus 3 is equal to 0.
Alright. And now the last one. Two. Again, another zero. Again, another zero. Okay, so now. Alright, so now 240. And how many times 240 comes in 48? How many times 240 comes in 48? We can just simply multiply. I'll just check it out. I guess it will be 5. I'm not sure. 48 into 5. Because is equal to 40 and 40. Alright. 4, 5 is the 23. Yes, I squat here. I predicted well. Now 4 minus 240. So 0, 0. Alright, so the basic thing which I have noticed that when the dividend is smaller than the, um, I mean, when the divisor is bigger than the dividend that time you need to just replace i mean you need to just place this zero point in the quotient all right and then like and then like you can just start the normal division and when you don't get the reminder as zero that time you need to just replace more zeros because the reminder is not zero but when it comes to normal division like when a number is smaller that time you just you just replace zeros on the top but over here the reminder is not matching i mean the reminder is not zero so we are just replacing these zeros to side to get the reminder as <coughs> uh, zero <coughs> all right so i hope you all have learned something new and subscribe my two channel and comment below that how was the video if you have any confusion i'll just comment it i'll just reply to you within 24 hours and thanks for watching all right always remember that this nine i mean this both are positive all right thanks for watching